So honey, ready? Three, two, one.
Okay guys, so they also have a wine list. And it's not just a wine list. It's literally pages and pages and pages and pages of wine. Most expensive so far. Fifty. You can find some. Oh, two thousand four hundred. Oh, there we go. Two thousand. Wait, two thousand. Where do you see the two? Oh yeah. Two thousand four hundred dollars for a bottle of wine. It's a whole bottle though. Chardonnay? Yeah, it's a Chardonnay from. No, it's not a Chardonnay. It's this one. It's from California though. Oh, the Chardonnay's only one hundred twenty-five. Yeah, the Chardonnay's only one hundred twenty-five. Actually, just kidding. Is that twenty points? Oh, snap. That's 24,000, you guys, for a wine that I can't pronounce from France. <laughs> Can I get that one, honey? I think everybody actually is. Why? But we're gonna, we're gonna probably get some wine. Are, are you trying to find the one that... I honestly see, didn't think we were in the thousands or tens of thousands. But we got into the 20s of thousands. See, Lauren is determined not to find the most expensive wine. But the cool thing is behind this is it is, these are bottles of wine. And they're labeled by, based on what type of wine they are, but also what country they're from. Um, and then at the very front of this, you can get it by the glass. These are all by the glass right here. And even then, I think the most expensive glass is what, 40? 48, 48 for the most expensive, which is not too, too bad. Did you just try to steal my glass of wine? Excuse you, excuse you. How is it? The last time we had a commercial reader was when we were in wine tasting. It's good. Yeah, it tastes really good. So we, I got a Gewurztraminer wine. Uh, Haley, what did you say? I don't think we are, because you said it a different way. But it comes from France. And it's really good. Cheers. The best thing about dining in the is, is the bread and butter. Yeah, well, yeah, you can have the butter. I gotta get it. But there's butter with, is that thyme you said on it? Yeah. Yeah, that is super cool. <laughs> oh, yes, absolutely. bring it back. So it's butter with thyme on it, and then um, three different kinds of bread. And are you excited? Flatbread, sourdough, and something with tomato. Yeah, flatbread, sourdough, and something with tomato. Tomato basil, I think you said, right? How is it? We're gonna enjoy the bread. <laughs> Lauren, you're so happy right now. So we both got the filet mignon. I got mine medium, and she got hers medium uh, well. What was what, what was that face for? Look at that! Look at that! It's amazing, but it comes Literally with potatoes and some veggies, and it's gonna be amazing. We're gonna enjoy it, right, honey? First bite, tell me what you think. Yeah, I'm excited. So I'm officially halfway through eating my steak, and by halfway, I mean like not even a quarter of the way. And this steak is heavenly. Right, honey? And we got more bread. By the way, of these breads, this one is the best one. In my opinion, this is the second best, and that's the third best. Lauren would disagree. Right, honey? Yeah. They're all good, though. Thank you. Look at all those wines. Okay, honey, which one of these? Oh, there's Remy. Which one of these do you think is the 20... $4,000 bottle of wine. I think it's this one. Or maybe that one. Okay, let's head on out, honey.
Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Man, they, they really pump the AC in there. Okay. Yeah, it's really cold in there. But I love how you literally cannot hear the music from out here and there. I like this song though that he's playing. So, official roll review of Nat Morose. Yeah. <laughs> um, so what did you think? Because this was our first time dining in like a normal table. Because the chef's table, for those of you who have never heard, the chef's table, it's an experience. It's a culinary experience. You don't know what you're going to eat and it's honestly amazing. I wish you guys a version of that. Probably in like November, December area. But it's wonderful. Um, but the steak here, oh my gosh, it's phenomenal. Thank you guys for coming on another adventure with us. Thank you guys for always watching. If you haven't done so already, subscribe down below. And until next time, see you guys later. Catch you on the next vlog. I love you. Funny joke by Lauren and go. Fun fact. What's about brown and sticky? What? Plastic. <laughs> You're so cute. And that's why I love you.